Wrapping up these 2011 World Championships here in Bratislava, Slovakia, the storylines are what stand out the most. In women's K1 class, Karina Kunle not only won the World Championships, she defended her title from last year. And she didn't just win, she won in style with a significant margin over second place Jana Dukatova, the local favorite. In the men's C2 class, it's only appropriate that there are two storylines that must be told. The Hawkshorners, the local favorites, stood up to the pressure and finished on top of the podium, coming away with the world championship title. But in second place, Fabien Lefebvre and his partner Denis Gargot, they not only finished with a silver medal in C2, Fabien also won a medal in the men's K1, and his partner Denis Gargot also won a medal in the men's C1. To have two people in three classes come away with three medals, that is an incredible story. There was no surprise in the men's K1 final to find names like Peter Kauser, Daniela Momenti, Alexander Grimm. But at the end of the day, it was Peter Kauser that came away with the title of world champion. After a disappointment in the home world championships in Totsen last year, he came here with something to prove, and he certainly did. In the men's C1 class, the storyline there was certainly the changing of the guard. Since 1993, Mardikan and Eston Gay have stood on the podium at every World Championships. This year was certainly a changing of the guard. With Denis Gargot from France in first place, Nico Batige from Germany in second, and Matej Benush from Slovakia in third. This is the second year C1 Women has been an official event at the World Championships. And it certainly has been a good indication to see the growth of the sport, as well as an excellent reminder of how difficult this sport is. We often look at these top athletes and we see them just rip through these courses and they make it look so easy. And it's a wonderful example to see the C1 women battling it out there, trying everything they can, and to remind us how very difficult the sport of whitewater is. Finishing first in the women's C1 class was Katerina Hushkova from the Czech Republic. In second was Nan Kin Shen from China. And in third was Katerina Makova from Slovakia. Thank you for tuning in to the ICF 2011 World Championships here in Bratislava, Slovakia. It was an incredible week of racing and incredible performances by athletes from a variety of countries. The storylines were immense and we are sure they will only thicken and continue to develop as the Olympics in London 2012 approach.